what is going on guys so in today's video I'm gonna show you guys my five best Bluetooth speakers that are under $60 now the thing is I have well over 20 Bluetooth speakers but a lot of them didn't pass a test because it lacked bass or it really didn't get loud enough or there was no mid-range or you have connectivity issues now I wanted to include a lot of other different speakers that did more than just be able to play music like a lot of the other Bluetooth speakers I have like some of them like levitate like this one here actually like levitates but you don't get really too much bass on this one this one here you can actually spin I have another one that's not only a Bluetooth speaker but it's also a wireless charger for your phone but this one here has absolutely no bass whatsoever you're pretty much better off just using your phone than this speaker here and then of course you have other ones where there's connectivity issues maybe once out of every like five or ten times you try to connect you always have issues or the volume just doesn't get like too loud maybe it'll get like double the volume of your phone but so then it's really not even worth it it's only double the volume of your phone and there's like no bass or nothing anyways let me go ahead and show you my five best ones and we'll start off with the most expensive which is almost sixty dollars okay all right guys so here is my five best speakers starting from the most expensive which is almost sixty dollars all the way down to seven seventeen dollars and ninety nine cents and these are all prices of today guys now let's go over each one of these really quickly and then what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put some songs on at max volume on each of these so you can make a comparison for yourself all right, so really quickly, let me go over each of these and then we'll start off with the music, playing the same music on each speaker at max volume, okay? So the first one here is the most expensive one. I think this is almost $60. Again, the prices are as of today, guys. So this one here is by iClever. Now the thing with this one, it's great bass, great crisp, clear sound. The only thing with this one is it's more just for home use, okay? You can't really... All the other ones you can take outside, you can keep it indoors or outdoors. This one here really isn't so portable. Now you have up to a 12 hour continuous playtime on this and you have two 10 watt drivers here. Also on the back here you can see that we have a auxiliary port here, SD card and your charging port to charge it. Of course you got the other buttons, volume up down, you can pick up phone calls, hang up, Bluetooth option and power. Another cool thing about this one too, it actually has LED lights on here. Have like kind of a night light and it has like three different brightnesses. It's all in the same color though, it's all in blue. Three different brightnesses on here. And moving on to the next one here, we have this one here. This is the Splendid Sound iPop Bluetooth speaker. You can see this one here has like a radiator, kind of for the airflow for the bass and this one does give nice bass nice deep bass you have dual 8 watt speakers here on each side and this is rated IP66 uh, water resistant or dust proof as well so a little bit of rain or splashes on there shouldn't have any effect on this and over here if I pop this side out here we can see that we have a charging port here and a auxiliary port here as well and of course on the top we have just the standard buttons here and you do have like kind of like a small LED light that comes on when you push the power on here. And I'll just show you really quickly. And this will turn blue just like that. And this one comes with a string here as well. And the next one we have here, this one is Daikaoyu. I think I have no idea how to pronounce it. But this is a super cool speaker. This one actually does have pretty decent bass. You can see the speaker like right in there and this one is cool because it has an LED like fire flame lamp you don't have to use a Bluetooth speaker if you don't want if you just want to use the light there you go or you can play music and have the light on the same time also what's cool about this too is if you look below it it has a tripod mount so you can mount this to any tripod if you wish as well we have the charging port right in this little flap here and you can see all the standard buttons are all on top here. And this one does give good bass. You guys will see in a second. And now we have the try bit here. Now this one here has, you can play music continuously up here up to 24 hours. Now also take note, all these speakers here guys, all these Bluetooth speakers, you can also 
charge these and play these at the same time. So technically you never have to, if you don't want to use these wirelessly, you can always have it plugged in as well. So this TriBit Bluetooth speaker is actually uh, water resistant and dust proof as well. It has a rating of IPX7. And this one here has two six watt speakers on each side here. And this one packs a punch too. And you can see all the standard buttons here are on top. If I, and if I pop this back here, we can also see that we do have a, um, an auxiliary port here and a charging port here. Nice little speaker here. And last but not least, now this is the cheapest one that we have, but I'll tell you, this one does pack a punch as well. I think this was $17.99. I actually got like three of these as uh, Christmas gifts. I gave three of these out as Christmas gifts. I mean, probably the best bang for the buck. Now this one here is by Muzili. This one has a FM radio. And what I like about this one actually is because it has an on off button here, okay? You don't always have to like press and hold for two seconds for the power button. Bluetooth mode. And this one does have a FM radio station function as well. And you can see all the standard buttons here. And if I flip it on the back here, we have a USB port here. We have a charging port, micro USB charging port, auxiliary in, the on off button. And you also have a SD card reader on here as well. I uh, almost forgot to mention with this one here. Now this one's kind of like a square. I don't think it looks sleek as like these ones that are kind of have like a rounded corner on these. The cool thing with these ones, if you're like in a tight space, you can always put it vertically as well. So instead of always having to have it lay down like flat like that, you have the option. Okay, with these, I mean, obviously you don't have the option. That it, don't, it only sits in one, one way and that's it, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and put music on each of these, the same music, and I'm going to put all the speakers on max volume. We're going to go ahead and start off with this one here. Here is the mic that I'm using. I just put it like right in front here, and let's go ahead and rock and roll, baby. Yeah! <laughs> All right, you heard that one here. And I can feel the bass shaking the table as well. Now we're going to go on to this one here. All right, it's paired to my phone. Let's do this. All right, next one. Let's go ahead and hook this one up to my phone. All right, so it's on max volume now. Let's do this. Well, there you go for that one. Let's move on to the try bit. Last but not least, this is the most inexpensive one on here. I think it's $17.99, but this one does pack a super punch. And let's put this on and wait till you hear this little bad boy. go let me just go ahead and show you guys my five best Bluetooth speakers right here well here you guys go let me know if you guys have any questions or anything just comment I'll try to reply to you guys and that's pretty much it for this review thanks for watching guys and I will see you on the next one